In this figure, we have a quadrilateral with two right angles. One side measures 16 units and another one 12 units. We are also given the area of this right triangle and we have to find the area of the entire quadrilateral. If we could find the area of this triangle, then we would add these areas together and we would get the area of the entire figure. Now, this triangle may or may not be a right triangle and with only one side given would be difficult to find the area. Of course, we can involve some trigonometry, but that will make the solution even more complicated. So instead, from this point, we will draw a perpendicular down to the bottom side and we will form two right triangles. And now, because here we have formed a rectangle and this is the diagonal, then if the area of this triangle is 42 square units, then the area of this triangle is also 42 square units. And now what is left is to find the area of this small triangle and to find this area we need to know at least two sides. If the bottom side of this quadrilateral is 16 units, then to find the bottom side of this triangle we will subtract 16 minus 12. Then this side is equal to 4. Now, if we look at this blue triangle, we find the area by multiplying the base and the height and then dividing the result by 2. So again, if we multiply the base and the height and we divide it by 2, we get the area. If in this formula we replace A with 42 and B with 12, then we will find the height. So then 12 times H over 2 equals 42. 12 divided by 2 is 6, then 6h equals 42, and if we divide both sides by 6, we will get that the height is 7. So we just found that this side of the quadrilateral is equal to 7. Then the left side of this small triangle is also equal to 7. And now to find the area of this triangle, we will multiply the base by the height and we will divide the result by 2. So again, to find the area, we will multiply the base 4 by the height 7 and we will divide the result by 2. Then 28 divided by 2 is 14. So we just found that the area of this triangle is 14 square units. And now to find the area of the entire quadrilateral, we will add 42, 42 and 14. So the total area equals 42 plus 42 plus 14 and this makes 98 square units. Now we have the problem completed and I hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe, leave a comment and thank you for watching.